Hi, my name is Niranjan and welcome to another episode of Champak Psyche where we teach you simple science experiments that you can try at home. And in today's episode, we're going to go retro because we're going to be making your own lava lamp. A lava lamp works on the interaction between two liquids of different densities. So in our lava lamp that we're going to make at home, we're going to need a few things. What are they? Well, first of all, we're going to need some oil. Now, I suggest you go as cheap as possible because you're going to be throwing this out when you're done. We're going to need a little bit of water, some paint to color the water, and finally, the actual where the actual magic happens, the chemical here, an effervescent tap. Now, this is the kind of tablet that you would use to treat, say, heartburn or, or indigestion. The idea is you drop this in water, bubbles are going to come out. So let's get started. Let's start off by taking our water here, adding a little bit of color. Let's go purple to make things a little interesting. And yep, that looks good. Next, what we do is we take our water and we dump it into the glass of oil. Now you'll notice that the water sinks right to the bottom. You've got a lot of bubbles too. We'll talk about this in just a bit. Now, we take our tab and we drop it in. And as soon as we drop it in, you start realizing the bubbles are going to start rising to the surface. And when you take a light and put it right under the glass, you get a really cool effect. So what's happening here? Now the oil sits on top of the water because the density of oil is much less than that of the water. Density of an object is basically the number of molecules of a substance that's packed into a given volume of space. So water is denser because there are more molecules of water in one milliliter and comparatively fewer in a milliliter of oil. Now the fewer molecules in the oil makes it lighter per unit volume and thus it floats above the water. Now when we drop the tablet in, the two chemicals it's made up of, sodium bicarbonate and citric acid, react and release carbon dioxide. The carbon dioxide latches itself to the water and takes it, takes it with it and goes up. Once the CO2 rises to the surface, it escapes and the denser water sinks back down to the bottom. Try this at home and tell me what your results were like. Leave them in the comments below. My name is Niranjan and thank you so much for watching this episode of Champak's IQ, which was brought to you by Champak and One Network. Thank you so much and please subscribe.